All right, welcome back to Crusader Kings 3 as the House of Dreon. I still don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly. Doesn't matter though, because it's my house. I can pronounce it whichever way I want. Uh, we are looking to get an heir that isn't this boy or his girl. Good scheme to murder her. Ideal. Very low. But the succession isn't ideal right now. We need a boy, basically. We need our wife to fall pregnant once again. And until then, we're just kind of sitting here, twiddling our thumbs, and reading about a device. So we all have a faith. Yeah, yeah, that's great. And we are Catholic, so we have armed pilgrimages, which, by the way, we have enough money for doing, so we might do a pilgrimage. And there's all kinds of stuff. Oh, let's actually talk about or read about fervor. Um, Holy was blah, blah, blah. Fervor represents how fanatical, yeah? Mm -hmm. Fervor is high, easier to convert counties. Makes sense. Fervor is low, decide to abandon the current faith. Okay, it's not too interesting. I thought there was more to it. Faith, doctrines, and tenets. Uh, so we could create a new Christian faith, but we have not enough of anything here. So uh, that's not that's not going to happen anytime soon. Right. So he looks a little bit too smug and happy for my liking. My boy, you need to lay with her. Oh, actually, what we could do. Uh, we should uh, romance her. I love it. It started a romance against Countess Bertha. Yes, we are attacking on all fronts. We are encircling. Uh, so, let's see. What is she like? Kingdom of East Francia. My, my. This girl has it all. So, she's an intellectual. Meaning, uh, something more in the... A ballad. I think a poem would be just the right thing for our wife. Um, da -da -da -da. Touch of your hand is the life-giving son of my world. I have no other desire but to see you, that I may know if you're warm or more like a corpse, my darling Bertha, my lord. Uh, yeah, okay, she's, she's, she's about as impressed as I am. What the heck are you thinking? He is not thinking a lot. Good God. It's a hundred percent chance and we start out with telling her we're happy she is not a corpse. Or rather, we would like to touch her to make sure that she is not dead. And just think of the implications. What does this say? Does this woman not blink enough to just qualify as alive by virtue of being alive? Does she not breathe? Does she not walk, talk? Grow, think, anything? Oh no. Oh yes, very good. Despite my terminal and failing to strike up a conversation, she's probably rendered speechless by the intensity of my affections. Okay, she farts. It was I. And she is disgusted. As she wasn't the one who actually... Oh. Oh, this is going good. Th this is... Um, progressing just like I envisioned it. <laughs> Send an extra, like, I farted! She just stares. Complete bewilderment. Why would you say such a thing? We want someone French. More French. Someone also French? Let's get her a matrilineal match. Wait, someone who's a little bit closer in age. 
all, all, maximum of five, let's see. Ow. Okay, we lost a good chunk of prestige there. Okay. Will you like a cat or a dog? I feel like more of a cat person because a dog is a lot of work. Saying that cat people are lazy, but... Uh, do you like the cat? I mean, she has the cat. Might be an indication of her liking the cat. I mean, I could speed up time, but I generally don't like doing that because history has shown me I tend to overlook things that are quite important to not be overlooked. Let's see. My god. Alright, this guy is insulting our dear lady. Should we attempt... No, no, he, he should apologize to the lady. And so he did. Both of us like us better for it. Why the hell are you even doing it? Get your wife, hey? Maybe maybe that helps you a little bit with your outburst there. But you don't get a good wife, you get a scaly one. Which now makes me think that's kind of unfair. Maybe she is a good wife, even though she is a bit scaly. Ah, yeah. Uh, pilgrimage, pilgrimage, pilgrimage. On to feast. We'll go on a pilgrimage. Um, uh, a woman screams. We will run to her and help while going on a pilgrimage. And we will go to Cologne because that's all we can afford. And we will leave... And she becomes our soulmate. Very good. What? Uh, she is. That is a very weird message. I stopped trying to romance as we can no longer become soulmates because we already are. Okay. Oh, hello there. Pilgrimage, love thy neighbor. Among my fellow pilgrims, there is a man who preaches compassion and fellowship until he reaches the topic of heathens. One evening around the campfire, loudly declares them to be abominable monsters in the eyes of God. Deviant and child by all. Most people avert their eyes when he looks at them. Tonight I was not quick enough. Do you not agree, O Count? Oh. We are zealous. We could become uh, disdainful of heathens. Every reinforcement rate, same faith. 20% faster levy reinforcement. That would be very stressful for us. We could just get disdain for heathens. But we can also get some um, piety out of it. So, truly, they spit in the face of God. Which is, by the way, a terrible, terrible take <laughs> as a Christian. That is definitely not a Christian core ideal. 
Oh, we should maybe check out if we can't get a court. I'm finally here, body and soul, at the great church of Cologne. As the bishop offers me blessing, I reflect on everything that has happened for God to bring me here at this moment in time. I have walked the holy path. So we become a determined pilgrim. Monthly piety per 9 plus 2%, which is due to being Catholic. And that's pretty neat. And we get a whole bunch of piety as well. We are now known for our devotion to our faith. Uh, and I was looking for this. No, I was looking for this. All right, we have prisoners. Um, ransom. Get a weak hook on on ourselves. Oh no, we get a weak hook on her. I don't know. Good recruiter. Worth anything? Her husband is really good. So she will likely bring her husband. Oh, he's the guy we, we took the uh, county from. Uh, uh, let's get a wee cook. Dead. And him? Who are you? What are you? Oh, you're quite... Huh? You learned. Come to my court. And we are back home. So we can once more attempt to impregnate our wife. Uh, he really hates us. Lord. But he will be our court physician. <laughs> court physicians. Is that what we want? Yes. Ah, we already have a court physician, so... Court tutor. Yeah. He's okay for it. He's okay for it. Doesn't really matter who is educating our daughter. Could spar with our son. Is there a chance we, we kill him or something? Might get a bonus. It's uh, very costly. What can we do with you? Uh, not ideal. <laughs> I don't care about cultures right now. Let's uh, try and find ourselves. Is she pregnant? Oh yeah, she is. Did I miss it? I feel like I missed the notification that she is pregnant. Give us a son. Give us a son. Come on, you can do it. Cat is hopefully helping. Need one son. There we go. Well done, us. Robert? I can't pronounce this name, so... Robert de Dreon. He shall be. Stuff. Love it. Primary heir is of the wrong dynasty. Yeah. I am aware. What do we do with you? 
I mean, don't have a lot of subjects. Imprisonment would just be the right thing to do. Just have to. Does it cause it? I don't think it gives us stress. Let's see if our boy allows himself to be imprisoned. Very good. That's not great for you. He goes definitely to the dungeon. Oh no, our, our boy Robert is sickly. All subjects lose another... It's um, it's an issue. Is a uh, big issue. <laughs> okay, let's uh, let's consider all this a little bit. Let's think about this for a moment. <laughs> I think we should go there real quick. Uh, let's let's get our kids a little bit of a positive punch there. This would make us a kinslayer, I believe. We lose the level of devotion. It's a difficult world. <laughs> what can I say? Okay. Um. I think we will educate our own son. Ay, 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 ay. Very difficult choices ahead of us. But we have now a son at least, so that's a little bit better. What's this? I've heard good things about you. I don't think you have heard of the right person then. But we shall start exchanging some letters with Duke Bernard II of Barcelona. All right. Thank you very much for watching. See you around next time. Until then, bye-bye.